Getting all started here. Life moves in San Mateo. Unpacking all the stuff. Gotta have a camera. And a strobe. So, background set up. Volunteers are decorating. It's really, really sweet. It's gonna be a good day. Okay, we're all set. So this is a typical set that I do. Although I didn't have the background with me for the last uh, couple years. It was too huge, it was 22 feet long, and I didn't have space for it. So I got the idea this summer to have it cut in half, I cut in half, and my sister Nick uh, hemmed it. So way more useful and it doesn't hog space in my rig. So we have a background to go, which is really nice. And certain shelters, it can be kind of hard to find a nice background that's just in existence there, especially in urban areas. So it's real simple. I use a single key light balanced with the ambient daylight. I do all these shoots uh, primarily outdoors and in the afternoons. So I always have light to work with. I go for the open shade, set up the background, get a bench, table, whatever. Then get my people nice and tight and close to each other. But you can see we just create a slice of a photo studio amidst regular life wherever I'm at. It's not a super dramatic setup, but the results are beautiful and professional, especially because I get in real tight on my people. So yeah, that's what a typical Jackdaw set looks like at a shelter. Just about done. We've shot seven families today. It's just been a total joy. <laughs> Such sweet people. So yeah, thank you. Thank you for making this possible, all the people that support this work. All right, so shoot is done. I'm mostly through the edit. I'm Photoshopping everybody's pics now. And uh, I'll be printing before I leave here. So my whole protocol now is I do all the edit Photoshop before I even leave. And then I make the prints, drop them off, and then I roll. And within a day or two, I get Wi-Fi at a library or a cafe or something and upload everybody's full res images to Dropbox and send them links. And they have all the pictures to do with as they wish, full resolution. Works really great. So yeah, this is the whole on the road edit bay. Printing, 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 before I go. This little Canon selfie printer is so cool. People just love getting a print at the end of the day. <laughs> okay, mission accomplished. Prints delivered, all the photoshopping's done. I just need to uh, go to the library on Monday when I have a big Wi-Fi connection. Upload all their uh, full res images to Dropbox files that I share with them. So. A wonderful day at the Life Moves Shelter in San Mateo. Thanks again to all my patrons and supporters who make this work and this gift possible. I'm going to go get dinner. <laughs> so I wanted to add something to the end of this video that I forgot to share with you yesterday. Shortly, I had just finished shooting. I was all done. And a man and his son, which... That's not a typical thing. It's usually uh, single moms here. Well, this was a single dad with his son. I photographed them, did portraits for them last spring when I was at the Life Moves shelter. And he came rushing up with his son and he said, Oh, hey, what? we're moving out. We've got a place. You know, things were changing for him, have changed dramatically for him and his son the last year. And they've secured housing. And he was so thrilled to see me and uh, shook my hand, said thank you again. That, you know, he keeps his, the portraits I shot, you know, framed up and on their, on their dresser in their bedroom, which is, that's the whole point, you know. And uh, about five minutes later, his son comes running up and gives me a 20 and dad's back there, you know. And I said, oh, hey, no, I have supporters for this. This is. You know, it's just covered, and he absolutely insisted because he said, no, things, I, I am working, I've got things going, I want to pay this forward, I want to help support what you're doing, you know, going forward for other families, and I accepted it, but uh, it's very moving, uh, it's, this work really does matter, and uh, moments like that 
really touch my heart and uh, make it all worthwhile.